Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Vergosity Gaming Minecraft Edition. I am so glad you could join us today. Last episode, Instagave and I installed the launch platform for the gondola skyline high above the town of Bento. Today it's time to build the amazing flying machine gondola that will allow us to glide over the landscape and see the full beauty of the town of Bento below. We're starting out in my creative world so we can get a good look at the gondola before we craft it in our Minecraft realm. It's gonna be awesome. So sit back. Let's hang out and play some Minecraft. So here's the extension for the platform that we had built at the end of the episode over above Destructo's house that is going to be the launch platform for the gondola. And we're going to just real quickly construct the diagonal flying machine because I just want you guys to see just how super simple it is. So a basic flying machine kind of looks like this. These two sticky pistons kind of facing each other like that. And then the observers kind of go like that. And when the observer moves, it'll trigger this piston. And then this observer will move, it'll trigger the other piston. It kind of goes back around. Now, that goes one direction. To make it go two directions, we're going to basically replicate the same thing, but on the bottom, and just turn 90 degrees. Just like that, okay? And then the observers face up into the slime blocks. Just like that. And then we should be able to trigger it just by triggering this observer here, I think. Yeah, there you go. And then what we're going to do is we're going to attach a couple slime blocks down to the front of it like this. And we're going to have the barrels there that you're going to be able to ride. And look, we've actually got it over here, and this is the return station for it. So let's go ahead and send it back. And it'll tuck itself real, real nice into the corner there. And then we're going to put the barrels that we're going to use to ride on it. Because right now it's just a flying machine. But with one very simple little thing, we're going to make it look like a gondola. All right, it settles right in there. We're going to put those there. And we're going to put a couple composters right down at the bottom. And now we have a gondola. So let's go ahead and try to hop in here and see if we can get it to... If we, we're gonna hop, hop in here, okay. And then we got a button right here that we're gonna hit. And send us on our way. Send us on our way. There we go. Now imagine this, looking down at the beautiful world of Bento. Very exciting. So let's go over to our realm and craft this thing. So I'm going to fire up our Minecraft realm, and I opened up one of our chat programs here, and there is a message from Destructo. Destructo said, So, I entered the Minecraft server and crashed while flying, and I spawned where we had our beds where the beehives were. So he spawned a long ways away when he had traveled all that way to go find those beehives many episodes ago. He said, I died on top of the gondola. So, I went ahead and logged into the Minecraft realm, and then this is what I saw. This is how I am repaid by being a good friend and making Destructo a nice box full of all sorts of wonderful equipment. What does he do with it? He just throws it on the ground and leaves it everywhere. Look at this. That's some good stuff right there, man. So there happens to be a chest right here, so I'm just going to throw most of this stuff back in there. I happen to be luckily had my inventory just cleaned out, so I know I didn't have any of these things. I think those slabs are mine, though. And this is mine. And Spider Fingers is still mine, and I'm not going to give him back all this other stuff because he doesn't deserve that. Look how he treats the valuables that I've given him, just throwing them all over the world. Oh, well. Well, guys, here's the uh, the gondola station here, and what we're going to do right now is we're going to construct that awning over the top of it, and then we'll put the flying machine together. And then we're going <laughs> to just kind of launch out and see how far we go and where it's going to take us. It's going to be kind of a test and uh, test by fire trial run here because we're just going to pray that we don't run into anything on the way. I think we'll be okay though. Just coming to stop over at Bento Bar here to have a quick little drink. Hang out with my buddy Carl and talk to Woody here, my little bartender friend. But I didn't see any of the other guys around. 
I don't know where the rest of them were, so I did some poking around. And many times, a villager has gotten themselves stuck in a place where they're not supposed to be. And once again, really what I need to do is I need to install a better door here. But what they do is they come through this door, they wander under the iron farm, and they start climbing these stairs, and somehow they get themselves up this ladder. I didn't know villagers could climb ladders, but look at where we found Lenny. What is he doing up here? This is not a good place. This is not safe for you, sir. I need you to come down, but I can't get him to move, and he doesn't want to do anything. Poor guy is just going to be stuck there forever and ever, I think. I wish I could get you down, Lenny, but I don't know what to do for you, buddy. Can you just, you know, follow me? Follow me, please. Oh. Oh, look, he's following me. Hey, 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 hey. All right. He's actually following me, I think. Oh, that hurt. All right, let's see if we can get him to go down the ladder, though. I don't think he's going to go down a ladder. Maybe. Will he? Oh. 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 Don't, don't go up. No, 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 no. Don't go back up there. Hang on, I'm going to take this ladder out. Okay. Well, we got him down. A little bit, anyways. Keep coming, buddy. Come on, Lenny. Ah. Come on. Don't you want to go outside and play with your friends? Let's go have a quick cocktail at the bar. But you need to... Uh-oh. Oh, dear. Okay, well. He's down another step. Wait, wait, wait. Don't go up. Don't go up. No! Don't go up there. Oh, my gosh. Why does he keep going up there? I can't push him off again. He's going to not survive if he takes one more tumble. Maybe. I don't know. Let's see. Oh, he's okay. Hang on. We're going to get... Okay. There. Now he can't get up there. <laughs> he doesn't want to go back down, though. Come on, buddy. This way. This way, please. Come on, man. There you go. Come on. Right down through here. There we go. Keep coming. I'm just going to break stairs so he can't go back up anymore. Yep, it's right out this way, sir. Right over here. Hello? It's over that way. Over there! I mean, am I going to have to push you all the way out the door? That's going to just stink. Ah. We need you to leave this area. We need you to leave this area immediately. Ah. Maybe we shove him out the window. Maybe we put him in a boat and shove him out the window. Yeah, let's make ourselves a boat real quick, and then we're going to just shove him out the window, and then we're going to install a better door right there, because that keeps happening. All right, we secured the door. Lenny's out of the boat. Let's see what he does. He should want to go to sleep, because it's nighttime. And there's a bed right over here he can go to. Come on, buddy. Let's go. Let's go sleep in his bed. Maybe let's break the bed. Maybe that'll do something. And then we'll be like, oh, it's a new bed. And he'll want to sleep in a new bed. Hmm. He doesn't seem to be doing a damn thing. He's just standing in the rain. Oh, come on, man. So, <laughs> I know you're a fisherman. You like the water, but that's besides the point. Go to bed. It's nighttime. It's not safe for you out here, sir. Well, we gave him a few nudges in the right direction, and it looks like he's going to make it back to bed. All right. Very good. All right. So we still got Carl. We still got Lenny. <laughs> I don't know what happened to Barney, though. Barney is MIA at this point, and I have a bad feeling about Barney. <laughs> look, it's the gib. Look, Don. Oh, look, it's raining. Because it's always raining in Bento. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> We are being super sneaks here, and we're spying on Insta. He doesn't know we're here, and we're not on chat with him right now. We're crouched down in the window up here. What's he doing? He looks like he's ripping out all of his crops. Oh, he just took a... He just wanted to get some wheat, and he's replanting some wheat. He's just doing a little farming, it looks like. That's all. Okay. I wonder what he's doing with all that wheat, though. What does he need wheat for? Hmm? Where's he going? Where'd he go? Well, where did you just go? Uh oh. There he is. What's he doing? Oh, he's just planting some crops. Look at him. Look at him over there. Ha ha ha. Let's see if we can, like, sneakily fire an arrow at him and maybe he won't know where we are. 
Oh no, I don't have any arrows at me. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> That's awful. Well guys, here we have it. Here is the gondola and the station and the platform all built. Let's hope anyways, I haven't tested it out. Like I said, there's gonna be trial by fire, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna hop in it, we're gonna launch it, and we're gonna go across as far as we wanna go, and then if we put a couple more blocks on this thing, I'm pretty sure it's gonna hit the push limit, so it, sh so it should stop. That's, you know, what I'm hoping anyways. I, uh, well, let's find out. So we're gonna hop in the gondola here. Oh, we got right in there, all right. And then we're gonna hit this button, and it should launch it. Let's go. Oh, well, it didn't take me. Oh, no, wait, I'm not in it. Oh, no, that's not good. I need to be in there. Oh. Ah. Uh. Oh, shoot. How? Oh, no. Oh, no, I need to be in it. It didn't take me with it. How am I going to get in there? How am I going to land on this thing? Oh, God. Oh. Oh, no. This might just be going into infinity. Can I possibly land on that? I don't think there's any way I can land on that thing. Come on now. A moving platform, maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Can we get right, like, just like that? Oh, and I can kind of walk with it at least. Oh, nope. That didn't work. Oh, where'd it go? Oh. Oh, God, I hope it doesn't. It's going to run into something eventually. We got to stop it somehow. I mean, it's looking like it's going... The way it's supposed to go so far, it's not going to hit the condo, is it? No, we're going to clear that. Actually, maybe I could stop it midair and then try to restart it. Alright, we're building a little bridge out here. We're going to try to intercept it. Somehow. It's going a little further over than I thought, though. Let's see. Come on, keep going. Go, 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 go. The same kind of thing, it's almost at the push limit, so if I throw a block on here somewhere, it should stop it. I just gotta get... Shoot. Alright, let's try to drop on it. Okay. Got it! Oh! Alright. Woo! That was intense. Alright, we're gonna try to jump out. We're gonna jump out. Here we go, right right now. Got it. Okay. Now, let's get up on the roof quick. Because it looks like it's going to stop up there. Go up, 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 up. Alright. Alright. Yep. We can stop it. There. Alright. We got it. Alright, so we can actually build the return station right here. Probably right just on that side of this thing here, so you come up and you can kind of see in the window, and then you go back the other direction. Beautiful, guys. That's going to look fantastic. All right. Somewhat successful test flight. Look, you got a view of Instacow sitting up here. <laughs> I love it. This really is one heck of a gondola ride, I have to say. I've been floating back across this thing for, I don't even know, a couple minutes now. So, we're going to have to charge quite a hefty price because we're not going to be able to give a lot of rides at a time because it's only going to be a two-seater. And if it takes five minutes to get there and back, man, we're going to have to charge $20, $30 ahead. But we're coming back up on the return, on the starting station here, and we're going to pray that it tucks us right into where we need to be. Let's hope this is going to be interesting. Let's see what happens here. It looks like it's coming exactly right for it, I gotta say. It looks like it's coming exactly perfect. Nice. Come tuck yourself right in here, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Get in there. Yeah, it's gonna come in here perfectly. Oh, it hit. Oh, am I one too low? Oh, I'm one too low on this. Okay. Well, that's okay. It almost made it. Yeah, I guess the... They sit there? Do they sit there? I guess they do. I thought they were one lower. Nope, I guess the composters, I had that one one lower than it needed to be. So, uh, I think we got some composters right here. Yeah, let's go ahead and throw these back on it. 
And then I think it should be good to go. We're getting, we got to give it another run across because we need to definitely stop it in the proper spot. But we needed to make sure it made its way back over here. So there, I think if we do that, and then we could actually just trigger this one observer here again, and it should send it the rest of the way. Yeah. Awesome with my flying skills. There we go. Okay, awesome. Well, if it doesn't get anything from this series, they're at least going to get seasick. Let's see if it's tucked in here properly. Yep, there we go. Perfect, because that's exactly where that needs to be. So we can hit that piston, fire it, and it will hit that observer. All right, let's ride it back across one more time now. Let's fill in these leaves here we ripped out like a maniac. All right, let's ride it one more time back across and then stop it in the proper spot at the for the return station. InstaCity Corp, we need to work on our employee situation. InstaCow is hanging out here, but he is not helping. Look at this, he's right in the way. And I can't get him to get out of my way. He keeps wanting to go on the gondola, but... Dude, you're supposed to be working. What are you doing? Make me some milk. Anyways, uh, I think we've got the return station ready to go. And we've got a button installed here, so we're going to give it a whirl. It actually kind of went okay the first last time. Now, this is a little tougher to get into. I don't know why, but it's just really hard to see in there. It's hard to see. There we go. Okay. So let's hit the button. Where's the button? And let's see if we go. All right. Oh, I fell out again, though. Hmm. That seems to be an issue. After many grueling hours and much heartache, InstaGib and I are proud to present... The Bento Craft Skyline gondola thing. This is our first test launch with two passengers. So, sir, would you like to do the honors? The button is behind you up on the furnace there. E gladly. Here All we right. go. Let's Three, try it. Two, one, and launch. Oh, ow. Oh, you didn't get here. Oh, no. <laughs> we have... Oh, hold All right. on. Hang on. I can, I can stop it here. Hang on. I can stop it and then... You can it was in, in. I was in. I think I glitched out of it. All right. Ready? Ready. Okay. Oh, oh God. Of course. You gotta be kidding me. It's raining. <laughs> uh, all right. Well, we're gonna do it in the rain anyways. All right. You in? Oh, yeah. man. Yeah. All right. There you go. It's a little, do you I know. To, you, I, do I have to keep holding anything? No, no, no. You just stand there. Just don't move. You can look around all you want, but just don't don't press your move movement things at all. Okay. I'm taking Are you damage. Hurt? I am. I might not be. I might be on the side of the thing a little bit more than I should yeah. be. Yeah. Very cool though. It's it's definitely a gondola. You can just like take a look at everything. Good good view. It's amazing views up here. It's actually almost better on the top. I I was thinking it would be worse up here. Because I thought it'd be cool if you're on the bottom, because so you could, you know, you hang down below it. But you kind of can see, you know, it gets going fast and then it slows down a little bit. But oh, oh, there's phantoms. Oh my god. All right, you know what? We're going to have to fight phantoms on the gondola. Where'd they go? Okay. Yeah. I don't I, have um, any. I don't oh. have any arrows. I don't have any arrows, and I'm taking damage. I'm just gonna swing at him with a sword. This is intense, man. Night fighting. Phantoms. Oh, nice shot, Tex. That was yeah. quite a distraction. Here we go. We're going by the, uh, by the... Oh, yeah. Eiffel, to Eiffel Tower. Iron Tower. Iron Tower. Damn it. I keep saying Eiffel. <laughs> Go back. Where where's the Eiffel Tower? Everybody's gonna say. <laughs> We're in Paris, you know. And Instacow is he's become a holy cow. He's floating. What? He's floating. He's floating in the air. You'll see when you get here, but I don't know because there's. It's weird because it's not like there's a block under him at all. <laughs> there's just holy. air. Like it's not like he's on top of a half slab and. He's pristine. ascending. He's completely ascending. Here we go. See, look at the cow. <laughs> Whoa, yeah, he is. Uh, he's like a helium balloon, dude. Hey, bud. Oh, no. Oh, it's one over. 
<laughs> okay. Nice. I took the other side this time. Thought I just saw another one of those stupid night things. No. <laughs> night just terrors. Seeing them. I'm just night seeing terrors. Them. You've seen them. I seen them. Oh, I hear him. I don't have any arrows still here. Uh, I can swing. I got it though. Wow, one shot. Yeah, I don't know how. I don't know how that works. One out. shot. You do not miss your chance to blow, cause opportunity strikes once in a lifetime. You better. Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> mm. There's a nice sunrise. I can't believe it's been raining though the entire, the entire first ride here. What the fuck? I mean, this is just, oh gosh. just so fitting. Are there more? Oh, there he is. Oh, be gone, vile phantom. We're, we're like sitting ducks up here. Oh, hit him, hit him. <laughs> Come on, Robin of the Hood. There we go. There you go. All right. Uh, That's very dope. That's very dope. Nice contraption. Did you see we're selling t-shirts now? <laughs> <laughs> nice. You want to buy a nice, uh, uh, oh, nice. let's see, Gondola Skyline t-shirt. It's uh, Hanes Extra Large Pre-Shrunk. You know, they're $5. <laughs> it's it's Hanes, a pretty good deal. It's Hanes. It's like, a Hanes. This is like a Louis Vuitton. This is a Hanes. It's a Hanes. I think it's like an 04. What do you want? We gotta start somewhere. And we're selling cool. cookies and pumpkin pie. You wanna sell Louis Vuitton shirts I here? I got Come a chipper. Now. I, I'm not even hungry, but I'll, I wanna eat this chipper. Yeah, I'm gonna grab a chocolate chip cookie also. I heard that these Bento Bakery chocolate chippers are mighty good cookies. Nom nom nom. Oh, it looks like you need two to fill up your appetite though hang on let's get one more going yeah you, got, you can't just have one. Oh wait it looks like i can actually have three cookies i wish you had some balloons I thought some about fireworks. putting some fireworks in too those two slime we should, we really are up there. Oh, no, no. oh what creepers Whoa. somehow over here jesus creepers i wow, have that's... no idea how because it is lit like the <laughs> Dickens wow, over here. he just came right around the corner and you saw Yes. Us. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, oh man. We need some security around here. You know? Mm. Yeah, we could do that. We should get we should get some security going around it going on around here. How do we do that? How do we institute huh. security? An well, we've been... an animals, dogs, and cats. Hell no. We've been farming iron for Near forever and ever and ever. Let's, uh, you know, let's see. How do we do that? What else do we need to make a iron golem? Um, you need a pumpkin head, a jack o' lantern, maybe. I think the jack o' lantern. A jack o' lantern. I have a handful of jack o' lanterns in. Oh, here. Let's just. Uh... Oh yeah, just you have to do it on the ground anyway. You have to. I mean, you got to get a shears, right? I, th I thought you oh, just right click can, it with. I can make a shears. Right here. Is it a shears or is it a hatchet? And then, uh, no, it's, I'm pretty sure it's a shears. So let's see. Can I do it right on him even? Oh, I have one here. Wait. Hello. There we go. Nice. Maybe we could have one patrol on the boardwalk up here. And Mr. Security Guard, say hello. All right. Oh, we should name these guys too. I mean, one's got to be Officer Krupke, right? Although, I don't know if anybody's going to get that. Do you even get that reference, Officer Krupke? I don't get it. Gee, Officer Krupke, we're very upset. Because no one loves a fellow with a social disease. There he is. Sounds familiar, but I still don't know it's what that from, reference is. from West Side Story. All right, there's Officer Krupke. Oh. There you go. And then here's an anvil. You can name. You want to name the other guy? I honestly have no idea what this even is, but I just wanted to fuck with the text here. 
<laughs> Jeez. <laughs> All right. This is. Yeah. It's just a series yeah. of like. Yeah. I mean, in the middle, literally in the middle, it says rice. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> so is this Officer Rice, I guess? <laughs> yeah, there you go. I'll, we'll take it as Officer Rice. All right. Wait, is he trying to go in my house? I don't need. Yeah, what does he get it back up? Oh, no, he's yeah, patrolling. Sir. Oh. <laughs> Report for reassignment. Officer Rice, come here. <laughs> you guys look like you're playing. Yeah, I know you push. No, I push you. No, I push you. Looks like he's being all shy. There he goes. Come on, buddy. Get that way. And with that, the Bento Skyline is now open for business. How exciting. Thank you guys for so much for tuning in. I really do appreciate it. If you enjoyed this episode, please remember to subscribe, comment, and like it if you will. Remember, you can click that YouTube bell to get notified as soon as a new episode comes up. As for me, I'm going to enjoy this last gondola ride before the crowd show up, the line wraps around the building, and I'm stuck behind the ticket counter. So, thanks again, guys. Have a great day, and I hope to see you next time. Bye-bye.